running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, we'll starve. Special super weapons of the future All because time. Because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. You're spiraling out of control, lady. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. Save Mr. Fox. Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AIU designed to control the system. Gaia, always with the with the pagan goddess worship suddenly in these games. Ah, come. But every time I think I have a lead, it comes to nothing. But at least you got them braids in your hair. And every night, I have the same dream. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky. Oh, the tree of life. Through a field of flowers. Again with the pagan symbology everywhere. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me. Even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. Yep. Man, the first 90 seconds is all pagan goddess stuff. And for a moment, I feel whole. You complete me, secret blood goddess mother. But it never lasts. Yeah, because it's a dream. Lonely at the top if you want to rock and roll. Come on, cutscene, let's go. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. Back up, back up, I'll do back up. It takes to get it. I promise. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So, what are we doing? Must be urgent. Dragging out a cutscene, so that's what. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the blight. Both, actually, but, um, I should... Oh, no. I've been dragging you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you. The Nora Jones? No what. You're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Yeah, with a bark on the wood, it's a bark at the moon. Bark at the moon. Come on, okay. cutscene for but Pete's sake. But you're going to come with me. You'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> Do you see what I see? A focus. Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information 
on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as yeah, we go. Yeah, bro. You're gonna have to, like, take remedial computer science or something, bro. Private Fakalite. What's a Fakalite? You see like this all the time? Privati Fakalite. Come on. I believe that's private facility. No, I'm pretty sure it's pr Privati Fakalite. This is what was once known as Cleveland. Not. Come on, bro, jump. All right, I got a couple of scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants, stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get focus, started. Focus, focus. Okay, here we go. Gather medicinal sky brush. These plants don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. The focus helps you see the ones we need. There. Those plants by the stream should do the trick. Got me some berries, bruh. Gonna make me a slushy later. Eat the medicinal berries. Well, how how do how how do what does that? Bitter. Yeah. Oh. At least they make you feel better. All right, we should keep going. I'm across me the river. I want to grab more of these plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. Are they more back there, or are they in the front, or the golden? Okay, let's go. Let's go forwards. <coughs> Examinai Blagati. Oh, some of the blight is it's peeling off. Dead skin. Is that how it spreads? Ugh. Those ruins, that's where we need to go. Are you gonna jump? Go for a swim? Fastest way down. Yeah, found your mama's phone number. Exactly. Backup? Well, um, it's an AI. It's um, it's hard to explain. Why come they don't let me like get that? A set of instructions that can fix the world. Sounds complicated. You're complicated. You noticed your uh, traveling life. Yeah. Well, what the heck, bro? <laughs> what 
Is there other stuff? Women, women. Aha. Uh -huh. I was going to say, is there a way to do the map? I need me a map because I'm a mapper. Place me a waypoint. All right, let's go. <coughs> oh, some of the blight is it's peeling off. Oh, dead skin. Dead skin mask. Is that how it spreads? Yeah. <laughs> oh, what's that? Salvaging machine carcasses as usual. And there they go. Looks like they left a carcass behind. Carcass. in that machine. Better take a closer look. Come on, chicky baby. Someone took down his machine recently. Who else would come here? I don't know. We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. Good thing we already picked up some Ridgewood. All right. Now to craft some arrows. Done. Me too. Arrows ready. Arrows at the ready. <laughs> and this is no sky brush. Uh, okay. Can't reach it from here. Nothing a well placed arrow can't knock free. Just have to target the lock. That did it. After you. I don't know, bruh. The transmission... The, uh, message I found. Didn't say. Only that a backup might be here. We need to find a way in. Goldthorn Pepper! So, um... What happened after I left Meridian? 
Well, there was a fuss when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. You were right about that. The blight's not just poisoning plants. It's killing animals too. Poor Mr. Fox. Then people will get sick too. And starve. We're not gonna let that happen. Stained red. The blight must be infecting the soil. Where I'm supposed to go, bro. Probably an electric vehicle. Because, <laughs> you know, it's just the apocalypse it is. Aloy, over here. Maybe we can get into the ruin this way. Down this way. Uh oh. Get to the grass. Never seen one of those before. Me neither. Most dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. Give it a second. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. Die. It's a weak spot. Right. You are the notebooka. Ocular component. You're an ocular component. Machine muscle. Machine muscle. Yeah, you 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 know that used to be my that used to be my nickname in junior high. Okay, concentrate.
You're dead, you know that? Another one's coming. How does the focus know all that? You're dead, you know that? data on the machine. Like a hunter studying its prey? Yeah, kind of. So after the fuss over me leaving, what did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother led the rest of the Nora home. The Sun King put his people to work rebuilding the city. And I set out to find you. Someone shot this machine, too. Another ladder. Need to shoot off the lock. Got it. You said you've had a focus since you were a child, right? Yeah. Found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. It's good to have extras. Texas. We'll be okay, Varl. Through here. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them? <laughs> Please hold for identity scan. You're an identity scan. Denied. Please wait here for personnel to assist you, Doctor Sobek. Okay. I guess they weren't on great terms with Elizabeth. Well, let's find a way in. Mm -hmm. Please hold for identity scan. Access denied. Credentials not recognized. I guess it doesn't like me either. I should be able to pry this open. Go power! There's climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above. Whoever left us here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? I don't know, bro. Ugh, what's that stench? Probably your mama's entire camp. Uh, I doubt. Baked potatoes. They must have come here to dump for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. And then through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. Kill water. Kill water. Uh, 
Examine the ruble. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. Corpse say. It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. You're an Osram this prototype. This looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. When in doubt, the pull it out. Focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. My focus brings the boys to the apocalypse. Poor guy. Damn right, it's That's better than yours. Examine Part of a machine could help fix the gears. So pick it up. Ooh, you're supposed to be a knight. What's, oh, something over there. Hop over things, chicky baby. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool, or maybe even make something better. You could use oh, this yeah? workbench. You're a workbench. Okay, let's craft something, I guess. Pull caster. Special gear up to our need. There. Uh, pole caster. Now to test it on the debris. Power! Girl power! Well, it doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. Huh. What's this thing for? Looks like I said console. Whoa. Good morning. I'm Oswald Bogard, and it is my pleasure to introduce you to. Were you like a Swede or a Dane? Forget what you think you know about us. Our truth is simple. We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Oh, yeah? Please proceed into the auditorium where we'll unveil our plans. Wonder what's in this auditorium. Hmm. Guess we'll find out. I 
don't think I can reach that ladder from here. Well, that door looks promising. But how do I get up there? Wow, that works. That pole caster is useful. That's what she said. Only one. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. Girl power! Okay, I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. Uh, Aloy, could you lower the ladder? Chill, bro. Thanks. Don't tell me what to do, Varl. Explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now far as Zenith is yeah, taking the next leap into ship the future. plane missile. <laughs> yeah, blow stuff up like, like Zelensky and Putin. Blowing it up in the wild. Let's go to war on three. Ah. In less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and It looks like a yo yo. Where no one's gone before. The serious system. The dog star. What the Egyptians think we came? See, it's all pagan stuff, bro. The Odyssey may take three hundred years to reach it, but when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Shivumbe. Shivumbe. You're a Shivumbe. Data corrupt. The playback stopped. <laughs> Immortality is data sky. corrupt. I bet. Between the stars? Uh, well, yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Probably had a diversity hire in the engineering crew. That's why I blew up. Boosh. Oh my god, I can't stop it. I can't believe it. Fair colony? Error. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Sure. Reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. Come on, man. Cut scenes like 45 minutes of the opening hour, bruh. We all know the projections. Economic instability. New biocontagions. Like, rampant AI. Like Fauci flu. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We oh, yeah. Don't, well, the world's elite, but screw the populace. And so we the general the populace, stars. whatever. If you fuckers in the medical community would quit messing with them viruses, we wouldn't have all these contagions. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest. Yeah, by manipulating Twitter, I bet. 
claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. I guess he's supposed to be well, like uh, right about the world ending. Elon Musk. Yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity, it was all a lie. Pretty much. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Pretty much. Yeah, well, <laughs> Bill Gates. for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. Got the center. There, the backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Oh, come on, man. I still can't believe the old ones could fly. They were capable of a lot of things. For good and bad. Sure seems like it. I wonder what it's like up there, among the stars. My focus might be able to help here. I should be able to pull that thing out of the wall. Looks like a giant metallic serpent. Keep your guard up. Oh, my guard is up. Oh, I bet. Up here. Friends from underground. Okay. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. Yeah, by the time you do something, Varl. Moving up. I need to sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. There's its patrol path. Closer and stay out of sight. I can throw a rock to distract it. Put it into a position where I can sneak up and strike. Just have to wait for the right moment. It's the time to throw. So how do I throw a rock? Hmm. How do I throw a rock?
Mine's down too. Good for you, Varl. Oh, that's the rock. Oh, I've got. Aha! Whoops. <laughs> I'm stupid, Billy. More of those machines ahead. Killed the other one, dude. What is going on? I guess I'm dead. Well, I'm stupid, Billy. Maybe.
You're dead, you know that? Sneaky, sneaky. Kill the machines, kill the machine, kill the mowers. You're dead, you know that? I've been meaning to mention. I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. Good. Sorry my whiskers offend you, anointed. She ain't no anointed and don't anointed Christos. Yes, you are Christos. Looks like this little guy got caught up in the blight. I couldn't escape. Poor Mr. Fox! I hope it didn't suffer long. Osram must have used explosives against the machines. They managed to get a couple. Looks like there was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. You're a training dummy. <laughs> she said for later. <laughs> Careful. Traps ahead. Huh. Might be able to disarm them. to salvage some supplies and not blow yourself up dismantled it and got more supplies you're gonna say that every time chicky baby Like another camp. While we're here, maybe we can make some traps of our own. Might come in handy against machines. Good idea. <clears throat> I 
<laughs> Got some chill water. Blast Paste! Bacini Muscles! Metal Shireens. I can use this. Blast the Pasty! Machine Musili Metal Sharidis. Okay. I should have what I need to craft a trap. Okay. So how do I do that? Oh hold open. There. Explosive trap made. If anything walks into one of those. Won't know what hit it. Over here, Aloy. I think I see a way up. Bro, you gotta do the loot. Say jump and tap. To attach gravel. Now what? 